This endangered species is Franklin's ground squirrel. Before DNA sequencing, this squirrel was formerly placed in the large ground squirrel genus. But after DNA sequencing, it got its own genus, a little closer to a prairie dog. It was named after British Arctic explorer Sir John Franklin. They are typically about 16 inches in total length and resembles the eastern gray squirrel with a shorter, less bushy tail, shorter ears, longer claws, and a patch of yellowish fur on the rump. It's also easily confused with the Richardson ground squirrel, which is more built, has a longer tail, and the Colombian ground squirrel, which has noticeably reddish fur. Franklin's ground squirrel has a number of scent glands. There are small glands at the corners of the mouth, which appear to be used when greeting other members of the same species. It also has a number of glands running from the shoulders down to the pelvis, which may be used to mark burrows. The endangered status of this squirrel is attributed to habitat fragmentation. They often remain in one area for a brief period before disappearing and establishing a colony somewhere else. They are only known to be above ground for about 10% of their time. They dig burrows that may be as deep as 8 feet underground with several branches and openings, and they build up a thick layer of fat during the late summer to sustain them during hibernation in the winter. By late September, every squirrel has chosen an underground spot in which to hibernate. They hibernate through the winter and emerge during late March and early April. Like many insects and animals, one of the first things they have available to them as food when they emerge from hibernation is dandelions, which are very important for habitats. If you'd like to learn more information, please visit Elgin Public Museum or check out my website, heatherdorshcreations.com. Click on the Endangered Species button to see all the animals and plants that I've painted for Elgin Public Museum's Endangered Illinois exhibit. As always, thank you for watching and let those dandelions grow.